It's time to get back to work and I'm looking forward to meeting my next client. My name is Lonnie Love. I'm originally from Detroit. I'm living now here in LA as a comedian. I'm here to see Lisa because I want to contact a loved one. Before today, I have never met Lisa Williams. I don't know nobody in her family. I don't know no cousins, nobody. I heard she could talk to the dead. Okay, Lisa, let's see. Hi, Hi. Lonnie. Nice to meet you, Lisa. How are you doing? Oh, I just love you. I love oh. your show. Lonnie well, Love walked through the door, and I was like, "I'm gonna have some fun here." And she'd seen the show, which makes my job a lot easier. So, so, so she knew what to expect. I'm very skeptical, Lisa. I'm like, I love your show. I've watched it, so I'm like, okay, if she can come and read with me, then I'll believe it. Okay. Okay, so you sent me a challenge. Yes. <laughs> yes. I love a challenge. <laughs> well, Lonnie told me she was skeptical right at the very beginning, and I thought, I'm going to change her mind. So, um, do you have a personal item I can help Yes, them? I do. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I've been given a few things in my time, but never a candlestick holder. <laughs> but that's cool. So, as long as it means something to you, that's the main thing. Yes. Okay. Huh. I have someone here. <laughs> okay, let's have a look. I've got a connection to a lady that's coming straight away like boom, in. Very, very strong. She's fun. And I don't know whether you two are very alike because she keeps giving me this whole fun element and the fact that you spent time together. Can you relate to this? Yes. And I feel she could talk. Yes. Mm, calm down. Whoa, 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 whoa. Slow down. Slow down. She's like... <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, whoa! She's a million miles an hour. Yes. Okay, thank you. Was she on your mum's side? Yes. Because I keep connecting with her mum on um, your mum's side, but I can't say it's your mother. Is it this your grandmother? Because I feel grandmother link here. That sounds exactly like Granny. That's Granny. Hi, Granny. Come on in. <laughs> Immediately when I was talking to Lisa, I mean, she was right on with the characteristics of my grandmother. And she wants to give a big sloppy kiss. Okay. Did she give a sloppy kiss? It's yes. like a big slop. Right. Uh, she call it sugar. <laughs> Give me some sugar. Oh, bless her. She's just planted a right sugary kiss on me as well. <laughs> Thanks, Grandma. That's what my grandmother always did. She always gave everybody sugar. She'd Give me some sugar, baby. Give me some sugar. And she even gave Lisa some sugar, which I got a little mad because I wanted some. Now, did, did she ever wear, like, elegant jewelry? Yes. She keeps acknowledging this gold band. I gave her a watch. Yes. Was it a gold watch? Yes, it was a Because that's what it is. Did it lose time, though? Yeah. <laughs> it did. She says she was always late whenever she wore it. <laughs> My grandmother was always late because of that watch that I gave her. But she loved that watch, so I, I'm just amazed. <laughs> <laughs> OK, am I making you a believer now? <laughs> Who's Molly? Because she's just acknowledged Molly. I don't believe this. <laughs> Molly is a little girl that I help um, at the girls' club down in L.A. And for her to have known that, I, I, I didn't mention that to anybody. Nobody knows about that. And she's a ray of sunshine, according to your grandmother. Oh, yes, she okay? is. She's saying, you're doing a good job. Keep it up. Wow. And she's poked you before now, or touch on the back or something. Yeah, when I go to sleep, I yeah. get this weird, it's that. Tell her stop doing that. That scares me. You just told her. <laughs> Sometimes at night, I get this, I get this feeling. Lisa revealed to me that it's actually my grandmother. I just hope, you know, when I'm with somebody, she leaves the room. <laughs> Grandma seeing me getting it on ain't right. You're on the right pathway. She says, that was a question for you. It was. That was a question for you. But you are on the right pathway. I was formerly an engineer, I quit my job, and then I just decided to do stand-up and entertain people professionally. And I've always wondered if that was the right path. Today, Lisa actually told me through my grandmother that she was proud of me, that I'm doing the right thing. She says, now, it's my time for, to go back. I've got a few cakes in the oven. <laughs> <laughs> and she says, now, I'll be waiting for you. I'll be the first one you all see. Yeah, Ty, I hope not too soon. <laughs> Says, no, I'm not planning on it just yet. <laughs> then all of a sudden, she's gone. Boom. Wow, that's, that was her. That was her. I didn't believe it. But really? now I do. 
thank you so much, You're Lisa. Welcome. I have enjoyed this time. It was so nice to visit with my grandmother and to know that she's watching over me. And thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. <laughs> oh, I love it. Lisa, it's got some powers. Now, if she could tell me the lottery numbers, oh, I'll be her friend for life. Well, you take care and okay. um, say hi to your mum from your grandmother. I will. I got some phone calls. <laughs> I think you have. All bye right. Bye. bye.